dolls it is she and welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome i hope that you'll go ahead and join the family hit the subscribe button and the bell notification so you can notify every time we upload here on youtube so for today's video as promised i am doing an update on the outre big beautiful hair clip ins that i did about Four weeks ago was the original video and I asked you guys if you want an update. You guys filled the comment section and said you definitely want an update. So your girl is here with that update and also a quick install with no hair left out. I know I did that in my original video but it was towards the end and a lot of people missed it. So for this video it's going to be a quick install as I talk through the pros and the cons of the update on this hair and then just little things that I've noticed over the past four weeks. Okay so starting out I have my hair just kind of pull back i am going to be talking about the hair as i do a really quick install so you guys can see exactly how quick it is to install this hair so before we get started don't say nothing about my brows they're going through a whole experience i went and got them ombre they just scabbed they're a little light but the color's supposed to come back so ignore my eyebrows and i can't put any makeup over them right now um but let's get into this hair so to start off with my hair i, I just have it pulled back into a bun as you can see here i wanted to show you guys how to do the install without leaving any lead out and in my original video I showed you guys that method but I showed that towards the end so if you didn't make it to the end of that video you only saw me install these in between my hair with all of my hair out so I just want to stick this one to a simple no leave out method because a lot of people are asking can you like do it without leave out so the answer is yes but to get into these clip-ins to update on them so I went ahead and I co-washed um the clip-in I did not put any shampoo on it I just put a little bit of water and a little bit of conditioner and um the hair it does feel a little bit dry but I haven't put any oil or anything on it I literally just washed these and let them air dry so they do need a little bit of oil um and it did shrink quite a bit so as you can see this hair is um has a good length to it but just like your real natural hair it did shrink up on you so um yeah, but as far as how they uh, perform, they're still performing just fine. So we are going to start in the back and work our way up. So I'm just starting with a small two clip. So the pros of this hair, um, the price I think is the number one pro. These clip-ins were, I always forget the price, but I'm going to correct myself on the screen if I'm saying it wrong, but I believe they were... Um, $21.99 for a set of natural hair clip-ins um, which you cannot beat. Um, I know a lot of people in my original video was asking you know what the quality was like so this is a human hair blend this is not virgin hair so I would not suggest putting any harsh chemical on it like any bleach or any dye or anything like that because I don't think it'll take well. Um, people were asking me about twist outs and things like that so I'm not a fan of the twist out look but I went ahead and I did twist out one of the clip-ins so you guys can see what that looks like if you do do it. So I twisted it out while it was wet. So I'm just going to go ahead and untwist this so we can see what the pattern's looking like. I don't know what it is. I'm just not even like on my actual natural hair. I've never been a fan of like the twist out look. I don't know. I don't know. I just like a good wash and go or a good froed out look or you know something like that. I don't know. Twist out just not not my steez. This is what the hair looks like. I take my twist for the twist out and let me hold it up next to one that was not twisted out. So as you can see you really can maximize on that length if you do twist it out. And then this is what it looks like completely um just as it naturally comes. I don't know this twist out actually is kind of cute. I might have just twisted it all. She 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 cute but um yeah so you can do a nice twist out or a nice braid out and it will be extra cute and it will give you some extra length. So I'm going to put this one in and next this is not a full like install or unboxing i will link the original video down below so you guys can check that out this is literally just a quick um just update on this hair so uh, again the hair it performs and it does exactly what it needs to do i do wish that there were less of two clip clip-ins like i mentioned in the um previous video they gave me i don't like the little two clip clip in i think i got the piece miller together i wish there were more three clips than there were two clips i believe there are like four or five um two clips and only like one three and one of each of the other ones so now i'm going to take that um three clip clip and i'm going to put that in the hair um like i said a little bit earlier it does come off a little bit dry especially after I um co-washed it so you will have to add moisture into this hair I would not suggest sleeping in these clippings just because again they're not 100% human hair or virgin hair so they will tangle a little bit on you um so I would definitely suggest um not sleeping in these so it's so quick to pop these in it literally takes about seven to ten minutes so just take them out before you go to bed 
and then pop them back in um, in the morning. So it's not it's not worth trying to sleep in them, being uncomfortable, because I do find that clip-ins can be a little bit uncomfortable when you sleep in them. Um, and it's just not worth it. So I would just definitely suggest taking them out at night, putting them away, keep them in a nice little silk bag or something, and then just pop them right back in in the morning when you're ready to go. And your hair is down in a ponytail, you know, protected. Make sure you put your silk scarf on at night, and then the next morning, you're ready to go. So these longer pieces are the pieces that I twisted out. So as you can see, um, without the twist out, it sits at about here. Um, when you twist it out, you see you get more length. So I'm going to probably wet these little pieces just so it can blend in with everything else. I'm definitely not going to cut it um, just because I don't really um, want the twist out look. But girl, this twist out might be a whole vibe. I'm going to have to do a little quick little twist out. If y'all want a video on a twist out or a braid out on this hair, y'all please let me know because I definitely will get that for y'all. So um, yeah, it really isn't much to say about this hair. I would definitely still 100% suggest it after um, wearing it all of this time. And it's been about four weeks since my initial um, review video. Um, and my, my stand still stay the same. I mean, you just really can't beat the deal on these hair. And then it looks and performs so much like natural hair. And that's the part that I really can't get over. Um, so I would say that these are definitely up there with some of my more expensive clip-ins. The only thing is that they probably just won't last as long because again, they're like a little a human hair blend. Oh, it looks like one of my clips is, looks like it's coming apart. So I'm going to have to stitch that, um, restitch that to the clip. So that is a little FYI. You may have to do some restitching because it does not look like after I washed it, the clips, you know, were as secure as one would want or hope. So yeah, this is everything installed. It was super quick, took me about seven to 10 minutes. The only update that I really have on this hair after four weeks is that it is 100% worth the try. And for the money, like you're really losing nothing. If you're looking to just dip your toe into the whole clipping game, I swear by clip-ins. As you can see here on my channel, I have multiple clip-in videos. I feel like it's just the simplest way to get just a new look quick fast simple it's a better alternative than wigs i just something about taking my hair off and putting it on it I, I just don't like with wigs and i can't remember the last time i had a sewing child so it's all about clip-ins for me so if you're looking to try clip-ins they can be extremely expensive especially some of the ones that i reviewed here on my channel so i wanted to do a inexpensive clip-in set for you guys this hair looks moves feels exactly like natural hair it has no weird smell you put your little oils and your creams on it i have had no problems with it reacting strange to different products i wouldn't go too heavy with the products because the more product you put on it the more you're going to have to wash it the more you wash it the more tangle is probably going to get oh tangles speaking of tangles there were some tangles and some shedding after i wash the hair so um there is some tangling and shedding just to let you know specifically on the ends as i co-wash and i was trying to come um, comb it through i was getting a lot of snags at the ends and i did have a couple of chunks that came out. actually let me show you something. i did have a couple pieces that came out in chunks like this piece here like that was not cut it kind of just pulled out in chunks so just um it wasn't a lot of this this was the only piece that came out you know being chunky like this but there was some shedding and a few snags and a few tags so that's just something to keep in mind but i feel like that is the nature of the beast when it comes to natural hair especially kinky coarse textures like you just always get tangling you always want to get shedding it just kind of is what it is so it was not od it's not over the top but it is enough to point out i try to point out whatever I can remember as far as the hair maintenance because to some people tangling and shedding is a big deal so I feel like it's very low maintenance you don't have to do much take it out when you go to sleep pop it back in the next morning and that is it so I hope that you guys enjoyed this video I hope that it's up guys because I know a lot of people in the comments from the original video asked definitely for an update so here I am with my four week update and please please be sure to check out my girl for the lashes if you're here in Atlanta support black businesses um and I will see you dolls in my next video